Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I appreciate your time. Thank you for watching. I want to give you some information about what's actually going on right now on Capitol Hill. I told you in a couple videos ago that in the lame duck session is when a lot of stuff gets done, the end of the legislative session, a lot of spending bills, a lot of appropriations bills, uh, the National Defense Authorization Act, these things happen every year, and stuffed inside of this year's omnibus spending package is a ton of gun control. This bill is 4,155 pages. There is no way that any representative or senator is gonna read this thing cover to cover and understand with detail everything that's in it, which is why they do these omnibus, actually, if you think omnibus bills should be unconstitutional, hit that subscribe button down below. Let's grow this channel and stick it to the man as far as knowledge and education. 4,100 pages plus lots of gun control. Now for some people who will want the bill, I'll try to pin it down below. It's HR 2617. I'll also have a link down below that Gun Owners of America has set up so that you can contact your representatives, your senators, to tell them not to approve the gun control in this spending bill. Now again, thanks to GOA for doing the work and reading this. I'm gonna tell you the things that are in this bill that you should mention when you contact your reps and your senators and also send this email down that in that link. So make the phone calls and send the messages via that link. Number one is a massive, a huge 14.1% budget increase for the ATF to facilitate the pistol brace ban that's coming in a couple days. Yeah, 14.1% increase in their budget, but that's not all. A $14.4 million uh, stipend line item for the ATF's NTC budget to maintain its illegal, searchable, nearly 1 billion record gun registry database. They've made over $700 million available to bribe states into accepting and uh, instituting red flag legislation. That's the bipartisan Safer Communities Act BS that they passed. Uh, remember when those, uh, those Republican senators uh, played turncoat, uh, remember them, get them out of office. They're directing the VA medical centers to utilize confiscation orders on vulnerable veterans. Uh, they also want the Department of Education to push safe storage for parents' firearms. The school's not going to tell me how I'm going to handle my items. The school can piss off. Um, funding for the VA to maintain gun storage maps and to keep tabs on where veterans keep guns. Again, Registry, BS. The seventh thing is new annual compensation for families of deceased ATF agents. I could, why would they want that? Well, line of duty deaths, yes, um, but increase the compensation. Are they anticipating more, more uh, uh, opportunities to, to pay this money out? I don't know, it makes you wonder. Uh, new gun control earmarks for uh, orchid healing circles and more. Uh, certain Dickey Amendment violations. Uh, with the CDC, remember the CDC, the Dickey Amendment is you can't use public dollar bills to uh, fund gun control. Well, the CDC, we've already put on this channel, we've proved that they're suppressing self-defense statistics and it's not going to stop. They want it to continue and they're going to pay them well for it. They also uh, have in their programs discouraging women from exercising their Second Amendment rights. They also have anti-gun community violence intervention initiatives. They're going to pay community-based... <sighs> action groups, uh, activists, because they're the ones who are going to be able to hold criminals responsible because that's how you fight crime. Yeah, more BS, just more funneling of money to the uh, those people who want to come out against the Second Amendment. And also um, violent anti-government ideology and domestic radicalization research. Wow. They really hate Americans who love their freedom. So again, 4,155 pages, $1.7 trillion in this spending bill. Link is down below to the bill itself, as well as the GOA link. So you can, with a couple of clicks, send a message to your reps, your senators, and tell them to cut this out. Now also, everything I mentioned, the GOA link will have more uh, information on there. It'll extrapolate a little more than I have the ability to do right now. Uh, we're here in East Tennessee, baby, for those who have been asking. Thank you for your time. I appreciate each and every single one of you. Uh, check out Blackout Coffee. We 
have the best coffees, teas, and hot chocolates, and whole bean, ground, flavored, K-Cups. That's what's kept me actually operating. Thank you to the guys and gals over at Blackout for sending me some coffee to keep me alive. And uh, I appreciate all y'all. Like and subscribe if you found this information infuriating. Like and subscribe if you want to keep the Second Amendment around. And until we see each other again, be safe, stay vigilant, carry a gun to keep you, your friends, your family, your community safe. That's what it's for, and we're not going to give it up. Take care, y'all.